Welcome to Fast Philosophy. This video is part of our Introduction to Logic series and explains what logic and arguments are. In everyday conversation, the word logic is often confused with order or nomologic or intuition. None of these are the logician's meaning of the word. Order is a systematic elimination. Nomologic is concerned with how the world really is and intuition is mere gut feeling. Whereas logic, in the proper sense of the word, is exclusively about arguments. So, what is an argument? Again, the everyday usage of the word is different from the logician's meaning. In English language lessons, you may think that arguments consist of rhetorical devices or appeals to emotion, and more generally, an argument's considered to be people shouting their opinions at each other. But this isn't what the logician means when he says that logic is about arguments. There's no such thing as logical or illogical rhetorical devices, and neither does the dynamic resonance of someone's voice matter. In logic, simple arguments are a set of premises and a conclusion. Premises are propositions which intend to support the conclusion by logical derivation. Both the premises and the conclusion are sentences which state things, rather than ones which ask. The meaning of a sentence which states something is called a proposition. Let's use some examples. Questions such as, will it rain today, do not appear in logical arguments. Instead, we may find the proposition, it will rain today. Together with other propositions, this one may form an argument. For instance, if my first premise is, it will rain today, and my second premise is, if it rains, then I should wear a coat out, then my conclusion would be, therefore, I should wear a coat out. This simple argument is made up of propositions, two of which are premises, and one is a conclusion supported by the premises. This is what the logician means by an argument.